Spikey, why are you doing this? Stop acting like a satellite. What? A satellite? What is a satellite? A satellite is a small object that revolves around a larger object in outer space. Can you think of an object that revolves around another object in space? Um, planets revolve around the sun? Yes, because planets are natural satellites that revolve around the sun. What do you mean by a natural satellite? Does that mean there is an artificial satellite too? Let's have a closer look at the types of satellites. Satellites are of two types natural satellites and artificial satellites. A natural object that revolves around another larger natural object in outer space is called a natural satellite. For example, the planets are natural satellites that revolve around the sun. The Earth's moon is also a natural satellite. It revolves in its fixed orbit around the Earth. What is an orbit? An orbit is a curved path of an object around another object. This is the orbit of the Moon around the Earth. Do you know that all the planets have a different number of moons? Mercury and Venus have no moon, the Earth has one moon, Mars has two moons, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune also have different number of moons. Moons are natural satellites of planets, and planets are natural satellites of the Sun. The Sun is a satellite too. No, Spikey. The Sun is not a satellite. Do you know why? Everything in space that revolves around other larger objects is a satellite. The Sun does not revolve around any object. So, it is not a satellite. Oh, now I understand. But what are artificial satellites? Man-made objects designed to be placed in an orbit around the Earth or a larger natural object in outer space are called artificial satellites. Why do we need an artificial satellite when we already have so many natural satellites in space? These satellites are used to transmit and receive signals, reports, and pictures from outer space. We also use these satellites for global communication, television broadcasting, and weather forecasting. What are you doing, Spikey? I am trying to throw my ball up in the sky to make it revolve around the Earth like an artificial satellite. That is not how we send an artificial satellite into space. These satellites are sent into space through a powerful vehicle called a rocket or a space shuttle. Did you know, in 1957, the Russians launched the first artificial satellite, Sputnik 1. Sputnik is a Russian term that means satellite. This satellite was equipped with a radio transmitter whose bleeps were received on the ground. Time for an exercise. How do we find our location anywhere in the world? We can find our location on Earth with the help of an artificial satellite. The artificial satellites help transmit signals from the satellite in space to the receiver on Earth. For example, the Global Positioning System, GPS, provides the location and time information to the GPS receiver in your phones. Time to summarize! A satellite is an object that revolves around a larger object in space. A natural object that revolves around another larger natural object in outer space is called a natural satellite, such as planets and moons. 
Man-made objects designed to be placed in an orbit around a larger object in space are known as artificial satellites. Artificial satellites are used for global communication, television broadcasting, and weather forecasting.